Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Today, guys, uh, we'll show you an auto repair, guys, how to fix a code that says left hand side seat belt pretensioner open or right hand side seat belt pretensioner open. We're working on that Land Rover, but procedure will be similar for many vehicles, guys. Stay with us. I'm gonna I'm gonna walk you through that stuff. Quick video, how to fix that, what is causing that problem. So let me just get inside quick. Okay, I'm going to turn the scanner on. Okay, you can see airbag light is on. Okay, so we have the computer here now. Okay, and we're going to connect to the airbag module. It's gonna take a couple seconds and we're going to read the code, guys. I wanna show you what's wrong with it. Quick, okay, read codes. And this is it right here. Open, open circuit, you can see fault in left hand side pretensioner. So, there is a couple possibilities for that thing. First of all, you will need to turn the ignition off. You will need to go ahead and disconnect the battery for at least one hour before proceeding and I'll show you what else we need to do. So guys, we took the seat off now. And the cable for the pretensioner, okay, the pretensioner itself, I forgot to mention, is this thing right there. So the cable, okay, usually it's a yellow one, it could be different one, it's this one right here. Sometimes you have a loose connection here, sometimes you have bad wires for moving the seat forward and backward all the time, especially if you move it uh, all the time. So, now that's, it, that's the wire for the pretensioner, so what we're going to do actually, we'll take the seat out, stay with us, and we'll replace it with a used one and see if that fixes our problem. So usually you can find a bolt there. Some vehicles might differ, but the concept is about the same. Okay, so we'll remove the bolt like that. It slides out, okay, and we'll pull it out now. All right, guys, we, we're getting it out now. You have to feed the wires through the same place that you remove them, don't forget that. Okay, that's the old pretensioner. Let's go get the new one, put it together and see what happens next. A video guys, how to actually test the pretensioner if it's good or not. Check it out, it's on our website. I think we demonstrated on a Ford Escape, but uh, again, many vehicles will be will be very similar procedure with, uh, with a moody meter, so uh, you'll probably be able to find it on our, on our YouTube channel. All right guys, this is the, this is the pretensioner here, the old one. We installed a new one now, okay. Let's go ahead, actually. Let's go ahead and start the vehicle now. I haven't even cleared the code yet. Okay, no airbag light. You see SRS should go away. Okay, perfect. So what I'm going to do quick, I'm gonna go Go ahead and erase the codes. Okay, let me turn the light off. And after we erase the codes, we'll check again. Because even if you don't erase them, the light will go off. But you have the code stored in the memory of the airbag module. Okay? So now let's see if we have that code present. No codes, guys. That fixed our problem. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, guys. Give us a like. Check out our website, Mechanic Wife Style. And see you next time.